Good day, ladies and gentlemen. I greet you all in the spirit of HPC and outreach. It is a great honor for me once again to join the ISC Outreach BOF, my second engagement following my initial participation in 2023. I am Teto Vuyo representing the CHPC in South Africa and National HPC facility. In alignment with this year's BOF theme, I am delighted to provide an update on the outreach activities discussed during last year's session. At the CHPC, we are fortunate to comprise a diverse group of South Africans, each contributing unique perspectives and solutions to drive democratized human capital development across our nation and the continent of Africa. Once again, our annual Coding Summer School has achieved significant reach this year, spanning all 26 universities and two national research institutes. This accomplishment was made possible through the dedication of university champions who are postgrad students stationed at each site, facilitating and coordinating our activities throughout the Coding Summer School. We also enjoy a strategic partnership with NITEX, the National Institute for Theoretical and Computational Sciences who provide crucial funding support for our endeavors. Our approach to curriculum development is dynamic and responsive. We gather comprehensive information about our participants and tailor course outlines to align with their interests and skill development needs. Through quizzes, mini projects, feedback, surveys, and regular meetings with champions, we continuously refine our approach to ensure maximum impact. These are some of the sites I show here of the participants engaged in the program's activities. To address historical structural inequalities, we have undertaken a bold initiative to translate modern computer science and engineering terminology into Sesotho Setswana, Isitosa, and Isizulu. CHPC staff members from these linguistic backgrounds lead the effort to create new terms and documentation, contributing to the preservation and evolution of native languages alongside technological advancements. In conclusion, I want to express my gratitude for your attention and continuous support. Thank you.